Kathy, how long is this going to take? We're running late already. I just want to browse for a few minutes. I love old books. Here, this one's old. The collected sermons of Cotton Mather? Not exactly what I had in mind. Perhaps I could be of some help. Uh, yes, yeah, she's looking for a book. Oh. Something very special. Um, first edition, maybe? Poetry? English poetry is at the end of aisle three. You can feel free to browse as long as you want. We've only got like 32 minutes. Young man, there is a video store on the next block. I understand they have vampire cheerleaders in stock. Hey, I read. I'm a lawyer. We shan't hold that against you. <laughs> I'll be back in 20 minutes. You're on your own for lunch, right, Cliff? We shall miss you, young man. Go oh, this way, please. Try this one. Tennyson. First edition. This is perfect. Thank you. great, isn't it? I love this place. It always makes me feel like Lorenzo de' Medici might walk in at any moment to discuss a commission. With you? Who else? But he will have to wait until I have finished having coffee with Simonetta Vespucci. She was Sandra Botticelli's great inspiration. You can see her face in all those paintings. You used to cut the crust off those. It's all right. I'm allowed to eat crusts. So it did. Simonetta and Botticelli meet for coffee on a regular basis? Oh, yeah, he was very fond of her. Even though she was destined to be with another, she loved Giuliano de' Medici. But Botticelli took them both to heart. Hey. Oh, it's all right. See? That's Simonetta? And Giuliano. They both became inspirations. And did they live happily ever after? And Giuliano was killed during the Pazzi Rebellion. And Simonetta was taken by a fever. Nothing is forever, Kathy. That's a strange thing for an artist to say. They live forever. Here. Can I have my book back? Yeah, sure. Well, hey, are you using that sketch pad? I just bought it. Great. Thanks. You know, they do sell those. Only to people with money. Where do you exhibit, Christopher? You haven't sold much of your work. My stuff is a little strange. Still, look up there. Yours? I ran up quite a tab. The owner took it as payment. 
He was like a million years old, Kathy. You would have loved him. He's dead now. I'm sorry. Still, that's a sale, isn't it? <laughs> kind of. You like it? No, 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 no. Don't tell me if you hate it, I'll be crushed. It's very powerful. You're talented, Christopher. You like it? Yes. I knew you would. So you'll pose for me, right? Oh, you never give up. Does a moth give up when he's seen the most beautiful flame he's ever beheld? That is a good way to get your wings singed. As into my profession, Kathy, my wings are forever singed. Okay, just sit there, sip your espresso, and let me sketch you. What can it hurt? Great, you won't be sorry, Kathy, I promise. Oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. You wouldn't have enough pencil, would you? <laughs> he had his sketch of me to work from, I suppose. But he must have painted you from memory. Astonishing, isn't it? You might even say magical. Now you're starting to sound like Christopher. Am I? Hmm. Why are you smiling? Christopher worked only in oils. Yes. Oils take months to dry completely, Catherine, sometimes years. This canvas. Don't say it. I have to hold on to some of my certainties, don't I? We shall lay our hands upon the basilisk and see the jewel in the toad's head. Champing his gilded oats, the hippogriff will stand in our stalls, and over our heads will float the bluebird singing of beautiful and impossible things, of things that are lovely and that never happen, of things that are not and that should be.